how is this for a job style? Like, I just did it so I didn't even look at the mirror. But then, I was like, oh, this is actually looking okay, nice. So how is this for a job style? I know some sisters actually do it like this. Some women, ladies. Couldn't catch the bus, so the work it is. This is going to be eventual because I'm tired of being able to do this work too, so... <laughs> and this is curious. is almost there too so this is spicy hot pepper so like i'm pretty sure it's gonna be spicy so my last ingredient which is the key ingredient is this ginger now the key to using ginger for your pepper soup is be very weary of how much like right now i'm still going to add more water but a teaspoon to two teaspoons should be good if I put more than that, if you put more ginger, it might turn bitter. And I know some people like bitter pepper soup, so like if it has like that tiny bitterness. But I don't. One time I tried it, it didn't work out. It is too bitter, so I'm not going for the bitter taste. So, just tiny bit. Not too much. Now, this is how much I took out. And if I need more... I will just add a little bit as I go. But right now, this is all I'm adding. So I added more water and I'm going to add more ginger accordingly. Now this is, you can see that it's literally almost seems like it has nothing. Yeah. It's gonna thicken up. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna add green onions and diced some onions to it and then yeah now i'm thinking this should be enough now if i need more i'll add more oh i i wanted to mix the beef and the shrimp together the shrimp taste might ruin the taste so i just decided to use to do it separately this is not a soup. This is just like a mixed vegetable shrimp thing. I'm gonna mix all this up and then I'm gonna cook it for some few minutes. And then, yeah. I didn't add water to this soup. I didn't add any water. But as you know, peppers come with water. A lot of water right away. So my diced onions and green onions, I'm thinking should I add like a tiny tomato paste? Should I or should I not? I'm still kind of deciding on that. And honestly, my cooking is, I just need this, this to cook, both of them, and I am done. Maybe I will add like a little bit of tomato paste and more more maggie cube and then also it seems like it's done i don't have rice if you like rice this will be really good to eat with rice 
but I don't have rice. Although I could make some noodles. Spicy. Chum to this. It's kind of weird. Kind of lessen the. Can help with the spiciness. Oop. So yeah, the tomato paste is gonna help with the spiciness, so it's not too much. Like it's gonna. If your stuff is too spicy, just add tomato. Any kind, any tomato really. It's gonna help with the spice. Just reduce it. I'm gonna add to this too. Very thick paste. See the color turn? See the color coming? A little more in here too. And I also do like um, broccoli. So I'm going to add this just at the very end. Mm. I wanted to add it to the pepper soup. But now that I'm thinking about it, I'm like, mm, I have veggies in one place. Maybe I should just put it in the veggies. You know what? I'm just going to put it in the veggies. Cooking, this is cooking. Oh, good. Add all spice and ground, ground cloves, and it turns it dark, but it still tastes good, not bitter, which is what I'm going for. Although not this dark, but still anyway. And this is my. <sighs> it tastes better than it looks. So, but I think it looks good too. Right? All right? Yeah, it is good too. So, and I think it looks good too. Anyways, now I'm making some noodles. I'm gonna eat. Okay, so this is beef from the pepper soup. My veggie mixed with shrimp and noodles. I'm going to work and me, I'm hungry. This will do. Just well hello see ya later the, i think i'm gonna conclude the video that i'm doing here and that will be the conclusion of the video here i think i'm gonna conclude it here or yeah <laughs> I decided to cook my my rice today like I have more over there which is cooling down and then but I can't taste it because I'm fasting now like I'm paying back my fast and then I made this broccoli and cauliflower stir fry if you call it that I I want so bad to know what it tastes like but so I have to go. I can't wait four more hours. Hmm. If it tastes good, then I will be trying it more. Like tr cooking in broccoli is more. And if it doesn't, then I'll try and make it better. <laughs> oh my god. I felt like I was gonna puke. I was gonna throw up. Yeah, were, yeah uh, the bus driver yeah, had to like open the window because oh. I was. Yeah, I was like puking and all. Yeah, I was feeling nauseous. Like now, like yeah, just now. Like oh, I thought that was like a few days that you. Oh no, it was just now when I was coming here. Oh, you had breakfast though. Um, 
Or you get no, wow. Maybe if I you don't, don't if you're hungry or things like that, maybe. Yeah, but it's been happening for like two days in a row now. Like we just yeah. while on the bus. Yeah. I don't know, maybe because of the heat. Probably it's yeah. just the weather too, right? Yeah. It's I could put your heart so they will know if your heart is broken or not. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a, a nice happy heart today, okay? Then I'll yes. tell me another two. Think of beautiful moments, I guess. Happy thoughts. Another day, another me walking home. I got this from work. You see me? You see me now? You see me? I have so many videos to edit. Yeah, there are plenty of mosquitoes outside. Like, oh, I'm trying to do this hijab, but it's not cooperating with me. Anyways. Anyways. So, yeah, there are plenty of mosquitoes now, like plenty. This thing, this thing, so this insect or whatever, you know, they be like, say they're very good at singing. Uh -uh. This, yeah, this mosquito, they be like, say they are very good at singing. Like the last time I was sleeping, I was just sleeping gently in my room, and this, this mosquito started singing. Like singing, you know. Like I say, it's my alarm. I have my own alarm. I don't need you, blood suckers. But anyways, what was I gonna say anyway? I was gonna say something, but now I forgot it. It's so hot. Like it is so hot. It though it is very hot, but it is also um kind of cool down. If it's like um this afternoon, yeah, this afternoon was brutal. Woo! You know, content creating is really hard though. Like, the rate that my hand hurts right now. So I want to say like, why haven't you gotten tripod? I mean, I mean, I have, I do have tripod, but it's broken. <laughs> so I need to get a new one. But anyway, see me complaining. Nobody ask you. Nobody ask you. I mean, see, somebody ask me. Nobody ask me. Nobody did though. Say be me. It's me that I saw a camera and then I started recording myself. But anyway, Sha, I'm sure we're going. You know what? I'm actually reading this book right now. I'm reading the skin. So anyway, I'm reading this book right now. I'm reading the the skin of the sea. No, no, hold on. I'm reading. Ouch! What is that? Okay, so I'm reading this book right now. It's called the skin. Of the sea, the skin of the sea. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's called the skin of the sea. If you hear the Adan going, that's because it's my good time. So, bear with me. So, yeah, it's called this. I'm pretty sure it's called the skin of the sea. This skin of the sea. The skin of the sea. By now, I have to remember the person that wrote it. It's not Natasha Bowen because I know that would be for and blood skin. That would be for Natasha Bowen. This one is uh, why can't I remember this? You know what? Because I don't want to lose this recording that I have with me, so I'm not going to go and find out what the name is. But yeah, I will put the name here, like somewhere around the screen. I'll put the name. But I'm pretty sure, yeah, it's a Nigerian, I think it's a Nigerian, yeah, it has to be a Nigerian, you know, because you know what, authors, like, their, what they write reflects their culture, where they come from, but I know that there are some other authors that also, like, challenge themselves and write outside their culture, but I'm pretty sure The Skin of the Sea is written by a Nigerian. But why didn't I remember? Why don't can't I remember the name of the author? Why? 
Why is that? Anyway, anyway, I finished working and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna have to walk home because if I take a cab, it's so expensive. And you know what? I've been trying to go to the gym anyway, and it's not, it has not been working out. So I was like, you know, I could just walk and that would count as my exercise. So, genius, isn't it? Very genius of me. You know me? Have you like say I'm getting chubby? I could have my cheeks. Mm. Like I'm getting chubby. It's like, mm, it's good. But then sometimes I feel like I'm not. Like it's just the camera. Like it's the lightning that making me look like I'm getting chubby. But anyways, anywho. Oh, the day is getting dark. So I think I'm gonna stop the video here. And. Look at my hijab, she doesn't want to cooperate with me. But anyway, Michelle will manage. Anyway, I'm gonna stop my video here. Because it's getting dark. Yeah, the day is getting dark. And yeah, I'll we'll stop the video here. And maybe maybe I will pick it up again and continue. Honestly, I don't know when the vlog or this video is going to end. I don't know when I'm going to edit, so <laughs> I, have, I still have like some that I did and I want to like edit and post them now. Like, you know, this content creating too. If you don't have the agility, the patience for it, it's like, God help you through. May Allah help you through. May, like really, may Allah help you through. But anyway, Shah, I didn't even say hi, hello or something. But anyway, if you watch it, to this stage hello hi salam alaikum you're welcome to the channel it's your girl <laughs> it's aisha anyway but so yeah you know the duties you do know the duties don't you yes you do so but anyways like subscribe share and comment but please like and do subscribe too anyway peace out bye bye and maybe i'll just give you one of my balloons but no, it's all for me. Okay, this is for lack of better hijab. Anyway, salam alaikum. We're here, Matatai, we're Yeah, so I'm on my way to a friend's house because, and you know, I'm keeping up with African time. Like that's not the original plan, but then like I got held up, so. But anyways, this is for lack of better hijab. I couldn't find any um, hijab. Yeah, like I have one beige, like kind of like a uh, color of my the dress that I'm wearing. I have one like that, but I couldn't find it. So I was like, you know, this blue kind of works. So I was like, this blue kind of works. So I put the blue one. So I don't. I hope it doesn't make me look like masquerade you know or this like color rioting or color riot whatever yeah you know in nigeria they will say oh what saturday glory sunday like you wear saturday on top of sunday this is the state of alberta right now yeah there have been wildfire and i guess so many of them that um where I kind of do something for you? Like, I feel like it brings out your color more, like even more. But anyways, um, yeah, there have been like so many wild wildfires, and, like between the populations and everything. And yeah, and a lot of smoke. Like the fire is not currently where I am. It's not in the city, but it's, it's in the, it's, it's in the south or the north. But anyway, it's in like either south or north and look at this yeah all these flowers like it's coming from this tree anyways so so yeah it's coming so yeah this smoke from either north or south is coming to us yeah we actually feel the smoke all around like about two days ago or three days ago was all foggy around here like very foggy yeah it was very foggy and it seems like another covid era 
So we all had to wear our mask two, three days ago. And I think the smoke was supposed to be here today too. But then now the wind, because it's actually quite windy right now, the wind is blowing up to another area. So which worked for us. Nice weather, nice life, nice outing. I believe it is Victoria Day or St. Patrick Day, I don't know, either one of that. So the bus are now working. So I'm just strolling down to my friend's house then. That's what's gonna happen. That's the way it's gonna happen. That's the way it is. But either way, anyway, I'm enjoying the weather. The weather is making me look nice, making me look good. Like it's sick. It's bringing out my color, if you know what I mean. So that is nice. Yeah, does um, my makeup does it make me look pale or? I think me. I think it's good. I think it's okay. But anyway, I don't know if you guys do this. I mean, I'm invited to. The, my friend's house and I brought my uh, my knitting crocheting kit and I'm like Aisha what are you doing but then I was like okay what way if we got bored and we want to do something like maybe like take a minute break talking so I was like let me just bring my crochet if ever I need it or if I don't and I don't know about you guys so, so I've been wanting to buy a new bag like handbag because everywhere I go I always brought, bring my backpack and today I don't have a handbag. I mean the, one, the last one that I had, it broke off and then I washed it and I ended up ruining it. I mean I've used it for quite a long time so I got a good use of it so if you know what I mean. And then I've been going to Ardennes and Walmart and I saw some beautiful bags and I was like, it's so expensive. Yeah, so I always be like, it's so expensive. So now, every time I'm going out now, and I'm like, I'm just going out on an outing. It's not like I'm going to school or even like work or maybe like shopping because I will use my backpack to go shopping because it actually comes in handy. You know? Yeah, when you have all those groceries, like your hands are giving off. It's like, oh, this bag come in handy then. But then, like, if you're going to out in, like, a celebration party and, like, visiting friends, like, Aisha, like, why? Let's just buy this bag and move on. But no, me, that wants to be cheap. I was like, oh, this is expensive. Now, see the trouble. Because today, when I was, like, coming, I was like, oh, oh, shoot. But I actually want to carry something so that I don't, I'm not empty-handed, especially because I have my crocheting kit. I was like... You know what? Aisha, we're just gonna be real and we're just gonna go with backpack because that's what we have. Yo, so yeah, that's what we have and that's what's gonna work. But I'm gonna enjoy my time anyway because it's been a while that I go out. Yeah, I'll have, I mean, I had a serious headache yesterday so and been working so I haven't had personal time. So it is gonna be personal time personal time anyways i'm almost there it's a been a nice stroll along it's actually not that long it's like i think about 15 10 minutes or actually less than 10 maybe about 10 minutes cap so gonna have fun honestly i have so many vlogs like this that i did and i haven't edited but it's gonna come it's gonna come it's getting there we're getting there step by step <laughs> step by step anyways have a nice time too, because I'm gonna have a good one. Did you didn't hear that? They've been discussing since like the past some minutes now. I don't know exactly where they are. They're outside here somewhere. So we join the discussion. A discussion for him.
I hope you get the full gist too. Because I do. <laughs> 